Okay, so build, proper building regulatory types have done much good science -y fire tests on straw bales and they're supposedly quite resistant to fire once they get their plaster on. Obviously not so good without the plaster, but we thought we'd do a little test of our own. So here we go. So I'm getting the feeling I might be here for a very long time, so I'm going to move a bit towards the edge where it's probably a bit more vulnerable. Ooh. Okay, so you can see immediate straw, like the loose straw catches immediately, which is expected. loose straw burns away. The straw bales, the actual like when they're compacted they're supposed to be reasonably fireproof anyway, it's only the loose bits that stick out the end. So from here I can see the cross section of the straw, so you can sort of see how it's blackened into the cross section of the plaster, and see how it's blackened into the cross section. So we're getting a bit of rosiness on the plaster. I would go to until the failure point, but I think that's not going to happen, so I'll just shift that onto the straw as well. Even that tightly packed straw is all really bone dry. It's the stuff around the edges that's burning where oxygen can get at it. This tightly packed stuff in the middle, it's like not really it's burning a little bit, but it sort of smoulders and then it's the stuff around the outside that burns. This kind of stuff burns very quickly. <laughs> Hmm, so quite fireproof I think. <laughs> Was intending to burn this whole bale and we had the hose and things on standby so it's a little bit disappointing in some ways. But there we go. Okay, so we had a think over lunch. Woo! <laughs> I mean, we like at the wrong angle. And of course we've set it up so we're going into the wind.
Soon after that we ran out of time. It all took a lot longer than expected. Mainly the bale stayed intact, which was kind of good. Even when the bale strings burnt through about halfway through this, it still held together quite well. The plaster on the outside really kept the structure together. So yeah, even though this was nothing like a scientific test, it still sort of shows straw bale construction sort of seems, on the surface at least, quite resistant to fire, especially if it's fully covered in plaster.